Hello folks, this is a short video to show you my latest project. I got hold of a DF Robot ESP8266 Fire Beetle board and I combined that with a Max 3100 blood oximetry and pulse meter. Here is the unit running, no finger on the sensor. Then I place my finger on the sensor and it immediately starts to read the blood oxygen level changes from my finger. On the left hand side you can see the uh, beats per minute. It's a little bit variable at the moment, it's still under development but um, this is an early stage prototype. It clearly operating showing beats per minute and changes of blood oxygen level. Next stage in the project will be to actually display blood oxygen level which should be around about 99% for most healthy adults. The, the display is almost similar to a uh, electrocardiogram. How did I connect it? There is the MAX 3100. It's an I2C bus connected over to the DF robot. ESP8266 on the uh, I2C bus pins. Fairly easy to connect and um, program the, the, the ESP8266 in the normal way. The first stage of the software is to wait for a finger to be placed on the sensor. It does that by detecting the IR response from the sensor and if it's below a certain value it presumes no finger is on the sensor. Then as soon as you put the finger on the sensor the text is cleared and the beats per minute starts to be displayed with changes in blood oxygen level as it moves up and down with blood flow. Overall I'm very pleased with the DF Robot Fire Beetle and the MAX 3100 sensor. The Fire Beetle is a predefined board in the Arduino IDE so that makes compilation easy, you just select the board obviously. The data and clock lines have pull up resistors on the board so that you can operate the I2C bus at uh, the fast rate of 400kHz. The DF Robot web page has full schematics and a driver available, although I didn't need to install a driver. has an onboard LED charger and uh, uses the CH340 UART. The onboard LiPo charger is extremely useful as the board will switch between 5 volt USB supply or the LiPo supply. There's lots of example codes on the on the DF Robot web page and, and both boards are very easy to use and the MAX 3100 sensor is very sensitive. You can use it for also measuring blood temperature or specifically blood oxygen level which should be about 99%. The code for this project's on GitHub G6EJD. Um, enjoy, I hope you do.